Alright guys, I've gotten a lot of personal messages and comments about people saying, I don't know how to make an activator and deactivator, and this has been happening a lot with invisible code. I mean, in all honesty, if you don't know how to make an activator and deactivator for your codes, you shouldn't be using any codes at all, seriously. It's really easy, and these people claim they're hackers, yet they can't even make activators and deactivators, but whatever. I'm going to help y'all niggas out, so... So let's just use a code for example so I can show you how to do it. Okay, invisible codes, you know, for all regions. Okay, so we'll use the um, USA code. Copy. And that's someone calling my cell phone at the moment if you hear that ringing. Alright, so we're going to put it in here. So what you need, since this is a USA code, these X's are for um, the controller, what type of controller, and each is different for what region you are. So a good way to find that is a boulder beak. And my computer's really laggy. So, yeah. Okay, load up boulder beak. Yada, yada, yada. There you go, the button activator. This has all the values that you need to find. If you guys notice, yeah, whenever it's Korean codes, they start off 2833 for like the controller addresses. Remember that if you're using Korean codes. So we gotta go to um, USA values, and these are it. Uh, but there's other values for like PAL, you know, JAP controller addresses. Um, so we gotta go to the USA. Uh, I use GCN, so. If you guys you just use the one whatever controller you use, you know, this classic nunchuck Wiimote. So I would use 3E80. So I'll go back to my code. And you'd put this in for both values, because you know you're not using separate controllers to deactivate and activate, you're using the same shit. So you plug those in. Now in order why 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 always equals why 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 equals F F F minus Z, Z, Z. Um, you, there are other ways in codes where they, the Y values are all zeros, but that means when you press your activator, you can't be pressing any other buttons at that time. But of course, you don't want to deal with that bullshit when you're racing. So in order to prevent that, you got to use that formula. So we're first going to find the Z values are the button values. And the button values, the Z values, are region free. They're the same for all regions. So we get, but they're, they differ in controllers. So here we are. We got the Z values for GCN. Let's say I want my start to be activate invisibility. Now, an important thing with the, G, the um, GCN, you have to add 80 to the hex every time you do this. All right. So we have a thousand. A thousand plus 80 in hex is a thousand and eighty. Now, if you did um, L button 40 and you add 80, it's not 120, it's actually 00 C0. Zero zero. Remember, you gotta do always do this in hex. But 1080 is 1080, so yeah. We're gonna go back to it. I want so we gotta plug that in. Oh my bad. So put 1080 here. Now remember the formula YYY equals FFF minus ZZZ. You bring this up. Now you gotta make sure your calculator is in scientific mode, then click on hex. And do F F F F minus ten eighty equals E F seven F. So that's the Y value for this. E F seven F. Okay, now the deactivator, let's say I want it to be the X button. Four hundred. Four hundred plus eighty in hex, remember you always do this in hex, is four eighty. So zero four eighty. And you know the formula F F F F F minus Z Z Z Z Z. So do the calculator, clear that out. F F F F minus 480 equals F B 7 F. F B 7 F. And there you go. So yeah, that would be USA code, GCN for you know invisible code. Star is activate. X is deact. And this code right here is the deactivator code. It, that's what co this code lets you deactivate invisibility. Um, there's other codes. Of course, you you apply this 
um, activator and deactor, deactivator method, other codes like mix out of this. Like, uh, let me see, I don't think I have it on here. Oh, here we go. Okay, here we go. This is your activator controller address and your deact. Your activator always goes on top, it's always above your deactivator. So, you know, you, for these values, just do the same thing like I just showed you. Alright, but if you run to a code where it's like a 0 4 line, and then another one for like when it goes like controller uh, address code, then you know the encode, then uh, deact controller, deact code, then final encode. A lot of codes are like in this format. Yeah, like I said, xxxxx gives your controller values, and you know it depends what region, what controller you are. The Z values are region free, but they differ for a controller. And you know what Y equals Y Y Y Y Y equals F F F F F and hex minus Z Z Z Z Z, and that is it. So yes, so yeah. All right, and um, that's it. That's how you do it. And um, also with invisible code, remember nothing changes on your screen. So if you want to know if your code works, you gotta do like get one of your friends in a worldwide or open room with you to tell you if it's working, because nothing changes on your screen. All right. So yeah, that's how you do it. Later.